Hey, this is Odds Mods again, and I'm going to be making a flip around three barreled night finder for HVZ. Basically, it'll be something I can keep in my pocket and I can just use it to take out those last few zombies. Whereas, one dart, if you're lucky, will most likely hit one, but unfortunately, I'm not expecting much range out of it. If you want more details on this mod, uh, at the end, there will be a link that you can click if you so choose that um, uh, I will put up a lot more details if you want to build this for HVZ I personally might build one just to mess around with but it will be a lot smaller there will be no grip you'll have to shoot it like this so stick around alright we all know the traditional night finder spring that you can get in there you can second spring it or whatever me I just went to Home Depot and got something else I got a replacement spring that fits perfectly inside the night finder. Due to my paranoia of things breaking on me, after I trimmed off the entire top piece up here, I went back in with plumber's epoxy to fill in all the space. Hopefully this will make it a lot stronger and won't break on me. So you saw the spring I was using, this is what I made. It's a triple barreled night finder minimize so it's one-handed nice thing about this one is I can uh, usually just flip it around like this for effect it makes it a, a nice little grip it's something you could make for HVZ that'd be a quick draw blaster and fortunately the ranges are abysmal I'm not kidding I'm being about 20 feet and I've got a huge spring in there but I do know that if I take out one of the darts and actually plug the hole with hot glue, the other two darts then shoot 40 feet. If you plug all the holes except one, you're doing about 60 to 80 feet if you're lucky. Um, but yeah, so that's what I did to minimize a uh, night finder. Uh, the reason why the this is minimal cut like this is because I need to integrate this. I've got plans for this. Although I will be sad, this is still fun to wield. It's kind of hard to flip in such a small space. All right. Well, anyway, I just shoot you shoot for you real quick. Just watch your fingers. Hey guys, so as I found out, firing three darts out of this thing gets me 15 feet, 20 at the most if I'm lucky. Average spread 5 to 15 feet. But I took a, one of my foam steffens, no way, in it, and I just wrapped it in e-tape and stuffed it down a third barrel. Now the ranges have greatly improved. I'm getting 30 to 40 feet now, with an average start spread of only 5 feet, which is great. I can still take one dart and hold it in place so it can still be single fired, but it's just fun to wield. It's uh, a little nose heavy, but once you get the hang of it, it's a lot like flipping around a real revolver. Now I realize I could easily make this even smaller because this tab back here keeps brushing against all my fingers and my palm. So I could easily cut that off and just add a key ring back here and probably would make it a lot easier to work with. But anyway, uh, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with this. Uh, if any of you guys are up for bidding for it, let me know, I might put it on eBay.